Hashem is guiding me and I have a purpose. If you don't have a purpose, so I understand why you're so lost and you have to have everything around you to have like people that don't have no faith in Hashem. So they need to have uh, a barbed wire around their house. They need to have a thick wall. They need to have an alarm and they need to have also to have, a, you know, to be in touch with a, with a, with a security uh, company that's going to come once in a few hours to... And nothing gonna make them quiet. Five locks and five, six doors, and 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 a dog, and 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 they're gonna be awake. Why? Because because they don't have faith. But when you have faith, look at Am Israel. Through all of the generations, they're going in Sukkot to live in this to to sleep in the Sukkot outside of the houses. Have you ever heard about something horrible that happened in Sukkot to people to Jews in Sukkot in the night of Sukkot? They were sleeping, and some. I don't know, Sone Israel came and never. How? In the houses, yes. But in the Sukkot, when they're in the streets, nothing. How can it be? Never. Never. Never in Sukkot. Why? Not never in Sukkot. Never in the Sukkah. Never in the Sukkah. In Sukkot, never. Why? Because the Sukkah, you, you show your faith in Hashem, nothing can happen. Is it logic? You have places that you're not allowed to go in the streets at night. You never go out from your house in the evening and in Sukkot, they sleep in the streets. What are you doing? Are you crazy? No. Yeah. Hashem is protecting. Why? Hashem is protecting according to how much faith that you have. If you show your lack of faith, so Hashem cannot reveal Himself to you. But if you say, no, I believe in you, yes, I count on you, yeah, I will try. So then Hashem is going to open another, going to, going, to, going, to, going to give you more opportunities to see that really He is there. When you